I'm sure we can all agree that Anchor makes some of the best power banks for charging our laptops and tablets and smartphones. And I use this one here on a daily basis. But if you need something a little bit bigger, there's Anchor Solix, which produces this right here, the F2000, which is known as a portable power station or solar generator to charge pretty much anything or plug in anything in your house in case the power goes out or if you wanna go out camping or even just have an event outside that you need to keep things running hours on end. But if you need something a little bit bigger than this, and this is big already, we've got something that can do that. As you can see, this is just a little bit bigger, the Anchor Solix F3800, which is nearly double the capacity of the F2000, but has a much larger inverter. So let's do a quick unboxing and check it out and see what this device can actually power. At its core, the Anchor Solix F3800 is simply a larger battery than those 10,000 milliamp hour batteries that you carry around with you to charge your smartphone or even just your laptop. But it also has that built-in inverter as well. Up until now, the Anchor Solix F2000 has been the largest system that the company has made. But as you can see, this F3800 is definitely a lot larger and a little bit heavier too. Now I did manage to get this thing unboxed on my own, but if you do have a second person around to help out, it'll definitely make things a lot easier, especially if you need to move it up or down a flight of stairs. While it is heavy, it's actually pretty easy to move around thanks to the four wheels that are on the bottom. And then there's a built-in expandable suitcase style handle that pulls out of the top of the unit. This means you can simply move it around from room to room and roll it exactly where you want. And just to make sure that it stays in place once you have it in the right spot, the two front wheels have locks that are built into them that can easily be engaged or disengaged with your foot. But let's talk about the battery and the overall capacity of that inverter. Based off of the spec sheet, this thing has automotive grade LFP batteries with a total capacity of 3,840 watt hours. But what makes this unit even more impressive is the built-in pure sine wave inverter that delivers up to 6,000 watts of power all at once. Along the right-hand side of this unit, that's where you're gonna find all the AC outlets here with a total of six that deliver 120 volts at 20 amp and then two additional ones that deliver 120 volt or 240 volt at 30 or 50 amps. This means you, you can plug in an RV directly into this and power it completely or even charge an electric vehicle in case of an emergency. Now having 120 volt and 240 volt from a single unit like this is extremely rare for a portable power station. So it's definitely nice to have in the F3800. And then of course you also have three USB-C ports that deliver 100 watts each, which is honestly pretty impressive. Two USB-A ports with 12 watt output for those older electronic devices that you still have lying around and a 12 volt DC car cigarette outlet that's capable of pushing 120 watts. All in all, you do have a lot of options when it comes to just plugging things into the Anchor Solix F3800. Okay, so now that we've got the basics down, it's time to plug things in and test this unit out to see what it's actually capable of. Since we're down in the basement, let's plug in the washing machine, the humidifier, and then maybe the mini fridge as well to see what we can get going with just a simple base load. So far, we only have about 350 watts of power draw here, so let's get a few extension cords and bring down a couple extra things to see how high we can push those numbers. So let's see if we can take things to the limit. First thing we're gonna do is plug in the air fryer and set that at about 350 degrees, which is probably good for some french fries. That's gonna bump things up significantly for us since the air fryer on its own can draw up to 1500 watts. But the 3800 definitely has a lot more headroom there since we have all the way to 6000 watts with that built-in inverter. Up next is the LG refrigerator and freezer combo that we have upstairs, which honestly shouldn't draw that much power. And then finally we brought down a toaster. And with all of that, we're only just pushing 2600 watts. The only other thing that we can think to plug in here is gonna be our microwave. And once we've got that set, it takes us only to 4,200 watts. 
Being able to power all of these appliances at once with that 6,000 watt inverter that's built into the power station is honestly pretty impressive. And while most appliances that we have in our houses run off of 120 volts, larger appliances like an electric oven, a clothes dryer, or even a hot water heater typically run off of 240 volts, which this does already. Having a single power station that can run pretty much anything in your house is something that I definitely recommend. I'm sure we could easily overwhelm this unit by simply plugging in an additional dozen or more electronic devices and run them all at once. But honestly, everything that you see right here is more than we run on a regular basis simultaneously. So I think this is a good test to pass. Now, one of the questions that I get on a regular basis regarding units just like this one is simply, how long is it gonna last? I know there are a lot of people out there who did purchase first generation power stations maybe five or six years ago and only got really three to four years of use out of them before the internal batteries degraded so much so that they only gave them about 50% of the original charge. Fortunately though, battery technology has gotten a lot better. So much so that the LFP batteries that are inside of here are actually rated for 3000 full charge cycles. This means you can charge it completely and discharge it completely every single day for 8.2 years. And at that point, you should still have 80% of the original capacity. So you, if you only use the system maybe once or twice a month for the longevity of it, you should be able to get 15 to 20 years before anything goes wrong here. And on top of that, Anchor Solix is offering a five-year warranty. So if anything does go wrong with the F3800, they'll either fix it or replace it and send you out a new unit. While you can't think of the Anchor Solix F3800 as just a larger version of the F3000, it was actually built to be a full home battery backup system. A single unit can actually be paired with six expansion batteries, delivering a total battery capacity of 26.88 kilowatt hours. Based on our average 530 kilowatt hour monthly consumption, that's about 50% more power than we use on a daily basis. But we do run things pretty lean here. So if that's not enough for your daily household power consumption, you can actually run two of these systems in parallel, giving you 1200 watts of total power output and nearly 54 kilowatt hours of total capacity. This also makes it the perfect replacement for a gas powered generator as an alternate power source for your house. But the best part about it is that the F3800 is significantly more quiet than that gas generators, which can be incredibly annoying, but also you don't have to deal with any of those fumes either. Personally, I never thought that we would need such a large battery system in our house since we've honestly managed fairly well with smaller ones like the Anchor Solix F2000 and others that are similar to that. But now that I've seen what the F3800 is capable of, I'm tempted to call an electrician down here and have them connect it to our home panel so that we have a no hassle battery backup system that's always ready to go. Anchors also make sure that that option is extremely easy as well with the Anchor Solex home power panel that allows the F3800 to power your backup loads in your house as soon as it detects that the grid electricity has been cut off. Or you can use it simply in combination with your current solar setup for your house. Getting a complete system like this connected to your electrical panel is fairly simple. Any certified electrician should honestly be able to get this installed into your house in just a few hours. For most, power blackouts or even just brownouts aren't a regular occurrence, maybe just happening two to three times a year. But if you live in states like California, New York, Texas, Pennsylvania, and other areas that get hit with extreme weather, you know how much of a nuisance that power outages can be on a regular basis. Having the F3800 on its own, or even with two to three of the expansion batteries could make a huge difference if you live in a city or neighborhood that gets hit with a power outage after a storm, or even during a heat wave during the summer, making it incredibly dangerous when you don't have a power system to run your air conditioning or even your heat. If you're thinking about picking up the Anchor Solix F3800, the retail price is set at $3,999. But since it's making its debut on Kickstarter, that means there's a significant discount there with a super early bird special that offers a 45% discount or just the regular early bird special if you don't get there early enough. And that's gonna knock down the price by 35%, making this one of the most accessible home power backup systems that I've ever seen. Those discount also apply to the various bundles as well, which include additional batteries and also the home power panel as well, if that's something that you're interested in. For more details about everything that's available over on Kickstarter, be sure to check out the link in the video description below. If you have any questions for me about the Anchor Solix F3800, be sure to leave them in the comments below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.